Hi. Well, I just got back. Um, sorry. Wait. From stretching my ears or getting them pierced, actually, but stretching them to a six gauge, like right off the bat. I went from zero to six gauge, and it, it's not that bad. Like, as you can see, I mean, it's pretty awesome. And you're saving like all that money from like buying all that jewelry that you have to like stretch with and all that stuff. Like, I'm pretty sure if I wait like a month, maybe two months, probably a month, but I can probably go to four gauge. So, I mean, it only cost me like like twenty bucks, ten dollars an ear. No, it was like thirty. Yeah, it was thirty. But I mean. It's going to cost you $10 an ear if you just go to, like, a 14-gauge. So, I mean, might as well, if you're planning on stretching, like, I don't understand why you wouldn't do that. I mean, it fucking hurt like a whore, but, I mean, it's fucking, it's going to hurt anyways. So, I don't see what the idea is behind, I don't know, getting, um, uh, like, a 14-gauge or whatever. It's like, you're going to spend like $15 per fucking like earpiece thing like for the taper and for the plug so each so that's like 14 12 that's like three sizes four sizes it's like a lot of money so why not just I bought these at Hot Topic six gauge uh, single flared because double flared I think would fucking hurt but um, single flare for like eighteen dollars, and they had buy one get one off, half off, so it was like it was eighteen. It was like twenty nine dollars or something like that. So all in all, I spent like sixty, maybe seventy bucks. And yeah, you would have spent like triple that on buying all that jewelry. So I don't know, but just yeah, bye.